Another big race was the 7th Congressional District. Our team coverage continues with Annie Rose Ramos and those results. Good morning, Annie Rose. Lynn, good morning. Well, the Associated Press has declared Kwaise Mfume the winner against opponent Republican Kimberly Klasik. Now, just a few hours ago, he gave a victory speech. Here's what he had to say. I have to take this off so that you know that I'm really smiling. <laughs> Congressman Kwaisi Mfume will return to Washington after winning the special election in April, which was held to fill the vacancy left by the late Elijah Cummings. The former NAACP leader held the same seat before Cummings. He says his first priority will be fighting the coronavirus. As I have said before, that all of my attention, all of my energy, all of my focus in the United States Congress in the coming weeks will be as it should be, using science, data, and common sense to help our nation get through this dark and difficult part of our history. On Twitter, his opponent Kimberly Klasik tweeted her response, saying in part, quote, It's sad someone that doesn't lift a finger could win a congressional seat just by his name. But this is not the end. This is still a win. Congratulations. Prepare to be held accountable like never before. And Lynn Mfume also pledged to prioritize police reform and help people get through this pandemic. Reporting live, I'm Rose Ramos for WJZ.